This is AP News Minute. The hotel housekeeper accusing former IMF leader Dominique Strauss-Kahn of sexual assault has spoken out publicly for the first time in an interview with Newsweek magazine. The woman says she wanted to tell her story because she wants Strauss-Kahn behind bars. China's railway minister has apologized for a bullet train crash that killed at least 38 people and injured more than 190. But the railway's minister and government officials haven't explained why a second train was apparently not warned there was a stalled train in its path. With an August 2nd deadline just over a week away, the work goes on in an effort to reach a deficit-cutting compromise and raise the government's borrowing limit. House Republicans and Senate Democrats are readying rival debt limit emergency plans. President Barack Obama spoke with House Speaker John Boehner by phone Sunday, then met with Senate Democratic Leader Harry Reid and House Democratic Leader Nancy Pelosi at the White House. An end may be near for the NFL's four-month lockout. The Players' Executive Committee is set to meet today in Washington after lawyers work through the weekend on issues that are holding up a labor agreement with owners. Ed Donahue, the Associated Press, with AP News Minute.